Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, thanks for joining me today for my plan with me for the week of June 22nd through the 28th. Uh, this week I'm using a kit from Sweet Kawaii Design uh, and it's kind of the opposite vibe from <laughs> my kit that I used last week, which was Serenity. And this week is, uh, it's just called 90s uh, and it's all the 90s vibes, bright colors and just all kinds of fun stuff. So I really was drawn to that this week for some reason. Summer's officially starting, and yeah, so I just wanted kind of a colorful kit to kind of kick that off. So uh, this is, I am using the, her uh, size of her kit that I'm using today is the Itty Bitty, and it, they are very, very small, but they fit really well into the Cousin. So um, I had used one of her other sizes before, but this one works a lot better. So the first thing I did was uh, it comes with two strips of washi and I noticed that they were the one size was exactly the right length to cover uh, the days of the week um, Thursday through Sunday there on the left hand side there so um, I went ahead and cut I decided just to go ahead and cut down the right hand side one there and put those across the uh, to cover the days of the week so um it was a perfect fit so I was really kind of surprised I wasn't expecting that this is actually the first one of her itty bitty kits that I've tried so it was um, a little bit of trial and error but I knew I had seen other people use this size in the cousin so I figured it would be totally fine so uh now I'm just doing the date covers I went ahead and she includes date dots with her kits so I went ahead and put those onto the date covers uh, ahead of time just to kind of um, save, I don't know, I don't know why, <laughs> I just did. Um, and so I went ahead and put those down uh, on the days of the week there and I kind of layered them on a little bit on top of that washi. Um, I could have put, I could have put them, um, you know, clear down under the washi, but I decided to go ahead and layer them. Her sticker paper is, um, it's almost like that unicorn paper. It is so soft and removable. Like it's, it is amazing. It's just, yeah, it's a really neat, um, paper. So, um, but it's also really soft. So like when I layered those date covers on top of that washi, you could kind of see the bump where it overlaps. So next time I'll probably just, I, you know, put them down below the actual washi so but it doesn't bother me too much so uh, I grabbed a couple of my washi from Simply Gilded and I decided to go with the pink and purple one because they matched perfectly so then I just ran a couple strips of those along the bottom there and in her plan with me kits you get five sheets of stickers and um, you get the um, everything that you need basically you get the all the different sizes of boxes you get checklist trackers um everything so it's it's a really full kit uh, and very very good priced also and i do have a referral code so i will link her website below and then also put my referral code down there if you want to use that um and then i went ahead and put down the hello weekend sticker above friday or uh, saturday and sunday there and now i'm starting to build my sidebar now her stickers are more narrow and you can kind of see where it sits on the page there. Um, so I decided to kind of go instead of, I, I, at first I thought maybe I would move it to the clear to the left side of that washi. I decided to go ahead and center it in the actual column, the squares, you know, the, the grid itself. Um, and I think it turned out great. I really like it. So I went ahead and put down that weekly box there for uh, meals and then she also includes three tracker boxes in her kits so I went ahead and put down all three of those and I'm going to use those this week for uh, several different things and then um, yeah you can kind of see how it how it kind of builds onto itself there to kind of fill in that whole sidebar and then I got to the top and I was gonna put down a full box, but it was a little bit too tall. It started to cover up that calendar. Uh, so I went ahead and grabbed one of her boxes there. It would be like a half box size. 
and put a this week sticker from Mandy Lynn Plans. Uh, so, and if you're new here, um, I'm on her PR team, so I will put my PR code down below along with uh, her Etsy shop uh, from Mandy Lynn Plans, and I do have a code for her, so I'll put that below. Um, and then there was a little, uh, some little character stickers in this kit, so I put one down on the This Week sticker, and then the Meals sticker I put down, and she has some little... Um, utensil stickers that came in the kit. So I put one of those down next to the meals and I thought that turned out super cute. Uh, and then there are um, several of these, I suppose you'd call them like, like a header, um, several of those. So I decided to go ahead and um, follow the color pattern there that she had. And I put them all down for uh, one diff a different color for each day. Sorry, I couldn't find my words. Oh, goodness. Um, and then I put down the to-do list. And I'm going to try to color code <laughs> matching those headers uh, for the week. So uh, we'll see how that goes. Um, so I went ahead and put down the to-do list stickers there. And I, I kind of had gotten started and then decided I wanted to pull them all off because going back and forth to the page was just getting kind of monotonous. So I had to stop and pull all those off. And then I decided to put down the to-do sticker there on the header. And I don't know if I like it. So I need you guys to, I need your opinion. So drop me a comment below. Should I leave the to-do sticker or leave it plain? So definitely let me know. Um, and if you decide, if you guys think that I should put them, I'll go back and put them on uh, later in the week. So, um, now I'm just kind of filling in some different things there. I've got Thursday for my cleaning list. I use one of her cute little floppy disk stickers. <laughs> it just cracks me up. Uh, it just takes me back to high school. Um, and then a to clean sticker from Mandy Lynn Plans also in there. And then I'm putting down some of her deco sheets or deco stickers from the different sheets. Uh, the little ghetto blaster and the tape. The cassette tape just cracks me up. And then, yeah, just kind of filling in some different little guys around the page there. And then another floppy disk on Monday um, to just, I have a few things I need to do um, on Monday. So I wanted a, a little, a separate kind of to-do list for those. Uh, and then I took a half box, um, put that down on Tuesday. And then there was a quote, little quote sticker that said, too legit to quit. So I put that in there. Uh, and then she has these cute little cloud stickers in the kit as well. I decided to take my script stickers from Mandy Lynn Plans that say uh, film, edit, and upload and put them inside those cloud stickers. So I thought that was really kind of a cute, just kind of different way to, um, yeah, just uh, kind of highlight those a little bit. Just a different way to do it. So, and then I took the little, uh, dot stickers for Mandy Lynn plans and put those down and then I'll check when I check that off I'll put those or I'll check off <laughs> those when I do them in the little yellow dots so and then I've got that little full box guy the little sloth there um and a page flag for Tuesday that I uh, have an appointment and then I put another one down on Thursday because I need I think we're probably going to go to the library on that day and what am I doing? Oh, yes. Yeah, so the little piece of washi that I had cut off for Monday, Wednesday, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, I decided I didn't want to waste it. And so I decided to try to kind of put it um, at the top of that box or the, sorry, top of the sidebar. Uh, it was a little bit too tall. So I went ahead and cut it down and then it fit perfectly in that space between the calendar and the top of that uh, half box there. So I thought it turned out super cute. Thanks for joining me, guys. I really appreciate it. Uh, stay safe, and we'll talk to you later. Thanks, guys. Bye.